going 16 years ago when I was in college, right? You look at them Wybridge books or you look at, you know, your basic Preston Blair walk cycle, right? And it's really broad and you're like, okay, I'm referencing Preston Bear's walk cycle so I know exactly where the contact position, where the passing position, the down, the up, you know, the arcs, and then like, wow, I gotta walk, but it only took 12 poses or something like that, right? So that's like the vision of how you look at reference then, and then 16 years later, the tiny, tiny little nuggets of, of uh, subtlety that you can continue studying and applying to your work. So I know my eyes changed throughout these 16 years, just like your eyes and everyone else's eyes are gonna change, where you can see more than you could ever see. So back day one, you could only see 12 poses. That's as good as your eye got. And then you start studying reference and you're like, oh wow, I didn't know there was that double bounce in the elbow. And you start, well, I'm gonna apply that to my work, right? And then you're like, four years later, you're like, wow, I didn't know the foot turned in like that when I took a step. I, you know, you're just doing flapjacks, right? Like, cause that's the Preston Blair level your eyes are at. And you go even further and you're like, oh my God, look at that little tiny hip judder that happens here as the knees coming through and like there's this really feet barely leave the ground I didn't know that I've been doing these big clod hopper steps through the eight years of my career you know what I mean so your eyes change you're gonna be able and reference material this is one of the things that didn't exist on that level even back in the 16 years now you can get in there and if if you really pay attention there's incredible amounts to learn and apply to your work through looking at reference material and your your work just jumps it just jumps and it's not like I, I remember being slightly prejudiced against reference material in the old days I'm like I don't need that stuff that's phony or whatever but you're not rotoscoping you're referencing you're going in there and you're seeing you're like wow I did not know feet turn like that I did not know shoulders did that in a run cycle in a walk cycle whatever and you apply that knowledge to your animation fundamentals, the craft, and your just work shines. It just blows up. It goes to a whole different level. And it's gonna continue doing that for the whole rest of your life. You're gonna look at a walk 18 years after you started your first walk and you're gonna learn some new stuff. So it's invaluable.